linear relationship, and the correlation coefficient. Shown below are the scatter plots for four different data sets. Answer the questions that follow. The same response may be correct, may be the correct answer for more than one question. So I have four different scatter plots here, figures one, two, three, and four. My first question is, for which data set does the correlation coefficient r appear to be equal to negative one? Okay, now remember, a correlation coefficient of negative one means that my, the dots in my scatter plot are, have a negative slope, kind of, or follow a pattern where they start high and then going left to right get lower as they go. So this figure one is an example of a scatter plot that would have a negative correlation coefficient. Same with this one right here. They start high and then going left to right, they go lower. So this one would have a positive correlation coefficient because it starts low and going left to right, the dots get higher in a general pattern. This one, they're just kind of scattered all over the place. There's no general pattern. So for it to be close to negative one, I'm looking at one of these two. Those are the two with the negative um, correlation. And to be equal to negative one, that means that they line up pretty perfectly in, a, in an exact line. So the answer here would be figure one, okay? Which data set has an apparent positive but not perfect linear relationship between its two variables? So that would be figure four. I have a positive relationship. They start low, they tend to go high. If I found a line of best fit, it would have a positive slope. Um, but it's not a perfect relationship. They're not lined up, right, in a perfectly linear pattern. So this would be figure four. Which data set indicates the strongest linear relationship between its two variables? This one has the strongest linear relationship because it doesn't say positive or negative, could be either, right, but the data points fall into the most perfect line. So again, we have figure one as our answer.